the gingerbread man. He remembers this story as a kid. Got some pastries. The gingerbread man. Miss and Miss, Mr. and Miss Baker lived all alone, day after day. They baked big gooey cakes, sweet crumble pies, pipping hot pastries, but they had no one to share them with, and that made them very sad. They look kind of happy in that picture, but okay. Then one day, Miss Baker made a little gingerbread man to cheer them both up. He had jolly green, jolly jelly buttons and big and a big icing smile. Dusting the flour from her hands, she popped him into the oven. He looks yummy. <laughs> but to Mr. and Miss Baker's surprise, when the tray came out, the gingerbread man leaped onto the table and began skipping through the sugar. Tee hee hee, you can't catch me, he giggled. Bless my sin of stars, cried Miss Baker as they chased him over pots under pans all around the kitchen. But the gingerbread man was too quick for them and he jumped right out the window. Say deuces, bye, you can't catch me. Scurrying along the path, the gingerbread man ran into a very hungry cow. Mmm, look tasty, mooed the cow. And what fine jelly buttons you have. Mm -hmm. But the gingerbread man danced and pranced, singing, Run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And off he ran as fast as his little ginger legs, gingerbread legs could carry him. With a great murr, the cow thundered after the gingerbread man, past the milk churns, through the barn, and around, around the haystack until crash! The haystack tumbled over right on top of the cow. Milkshakes, cried the very dizzy cow. The gingerbread man scurried up the hill. At the top was a very hungry goat. Good day, bleated the goat. I love munching thistles, but you look even better to eat. But the gingerbread man just whirled and twirled, singing, Run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And off he zoomed, leaving a trail of gingerbread crumbs behind him. So the goat dashed after the gingerbread man through the thistles over the gate and in and out of the apple orchard until smash! The goat butted right into the tree and the apples came toppling down with thud, thud, thud. Oh, applesauce, cried the goat, rubbing his head. Tee-hee-hee, laughed the gingerbread man as he frolicked through the meadow. There, dozing in a tree, was a very hungry cat. Meow, meowed the cat. You look like the perfect snack. Sorry, you guys, I can't purr, so that's my best way. Anyways, continue on. The, but the gingerbread man just wiggled and giggled, singing, Run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And whooshed, racing down the lane. Licking her lips, the cat chased the gingerbread man around the bush, 
through the daisies, the cat through the daisies and towards the pond, the cat leaped up, up, up. And down, 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 splash, right into the middle of the cold, wet pond. Oh, whiskers, grumbled the very soggy cat. As the gingerbread man ran down the hill, he began to laugh and sing. Tee hee hee. I'm having fun. I've ran away from everyone. A curly haired woman, a man in a hat, a cow and a goat and a silly old cat. But when the gingerbread man reached towards the riverbank, he stopped and shivered. Boo! Too cold. How do I cross? Just then a fox appeared. Hello, little gingerbread man, he grinned. Maybe I can help you. Just climb on my tail, and I'll carry you across. Uh-oh. Brr! It's too chilly, the gingerbread man squealed as the fox paddled into the river. Then why don't you climb onto my back, asked the fox. Brr! Too wet, squeaked the gingerbread man as the water swirled at his feet. Climb onto my head, smirked the fox, and the gingerbread man scrambled up. But the water was rosing higher still, so the gingerbread man climbed to the top of the fox's nose. Tee hee hee! They'll never catch me! He cried just as. The fox tossed up the gingerbread man up, up, up into the air and opened his mouth wide. Snap! Snap! And that was the end of the gingerbread man. Oh, dear, sighed Miss Baker. What a naughty gingerbread man he was. I'm still hungry, mooed the cow. Me too, bleated the goat. So am I, meowed the cat. Then Miss Baker said, let's all go and bake something together, something else together. Boy, don't they look all happy. So they all trotted back into the bakery, mixing to mix and stir cakes and the pastries and pies. But no more gingerbread men. It was a fantastic feast with their three new friends. Mr. and Miss Baker were never lonely again. The end. And that was the gingerbread man. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And as much as I enjoy reading to my kiddos. Thank you. Have a blessed day. LT, the House of Tori, signing off.